Hey, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed. I just wanted to go over a couple things real quick that might be uh, hard to put in the animation. Um, you probably want to read some books about this. Uh, this one's a good place to start, especially if you're not into the whole natural healing thing. This is Lynn Farrell's The Iodine Crisis. Um, Dr. Brownstein wrote Iodine, Why You Need It, Why You Can't Live Without It. That gets into a little more technical stuff. Um, there's some Facebook groups that you want to check out. You've got uh, the main Iodine group. That's what it's called, is Iodine. That's run by Stephanie Boyst, and uh, that follows Dr. Brownstein's protocol pretty strictly. You've got Iodine Protocols, which is pretty much the same thing. It's sort of a spin-off, and that's a little more lax. And then uh, I made a group called uh, Iodine for Beginners, which um, I think the name implies what that's for. Uh, you've got Iodine Workshop, which gets into some more technical stuff. So if you like the science-y part, that's a good one. Um, that's about it. You'll get into some other ones. Uh, magnesium is an important part of this, so the Magnesium Advo Advocacy Group is good uh, to learn about magnesium, because magnesium by itself uh, can get pretty complex. Then you've got, um, you know, thyroid, uh, if you want to get into any of the specifics, selenium, vitamin C. Uh, there's a whole bunch of groups out there. Um, I'll go over the protocol real quick. You've got iodine, selenium, magnesium, vitamin C, unrefined salt, which is different than table salt, refined salt. Um, this stuff is going to be nice and chunky and have some other stuff in there. It's a lot different. And then you've got some optional ones like boron and ATP, which is vitamin B2 and 3. Um, I'm going to go over uh, iodine real quick. You've got liquid iodine, um, and this is Lugol's. This is a solution made by a guy back in the 1800s. Um, it's both forms that our body needs. Uh, you can get liquid just iodine potassium, or potassium iodide, sorry, which is just clear. Um, and then you can get that in like a rollerball form or something like that. But Lugol's is preferred by most uh, because it's got both forms in there. So this is liquid. There's also pills. You've got, um, which is a, a, a Lugol's concoction and a pill, and that's called um, Idoral and Lugol Tab. And the only issue I see with those is the fact that uh, they're made to bypass our stomach, and our stomach needs the iodine, and uh, then once it gets through the stomach, sometimes it goes too far and just gets passed and doesn't get absorbed. Um, there's a whole bunch of videos on the internet for iodine, um, or thyroid in general that start getting into iodine. Uh, there's a whole bunch of websites. I put a website together for you to help you wrap your head around this. That's called whyiodine.com. And uh, you can also hit up um, the sources for this video at whyiodine.com slash wewillthrive, and that's got hyphens in it, so it's we-will-thrive. And uh, some of the sources aren't the best. Um, you might have to pick through them a bit. If you're paying attention to the way uh, cannabis has been um, playing out recently, uh, it was demonized, and now that we're studying it, it's got all these magical properties. Uh, same things going on with iodine, so sometimes you kind of got to pick through and, uh, and see what's going on for yourself. There's a lot of people making money off of drugs that are replacing what iodine should be doing to our body, but they're not taking care of us the right way, and that's why people are still sick. So um, check out my site. Uh, it's not the end-all be-all. It's, uh, it's a good starting point. You want to... I, I suggest you start there, read some things, and then head out into whatever direction you need to go. The groups are great for learning. Um, if you are sick or you know somebody that's sick, uh, it's best to get hire a doctor sooner than later. It's best to hire a doctor anyway, but a lot of people like myself do this without a doctor. Um, you've got uh, Dr. Brownstein, I believe, still does consultations. Um, Dr. Uh, Teresa Peters does consultations, um, and there's a few others. I'll link that up on my page. That way I can keep you up to date, um, and we don't have to worry about how old this video is. But uh, check it out. I hope to see you in the groups, and uh, I hope to see you start doing some healing. So uh, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you later.